Hello again guys. Uh, this one's gonna really send you crazy now. This is my Nexus 7 connected to a DVD player and it's working. I got it to work. I'm using a uh, Samsung Optical Smart Hub which I have previously demoed using wirelessly uh, with my Nexus 7. I'm using that as my uh, travel router come DVD player. Uh, and uh, I've also used this as an as my in-car entertainment system. Now I'm using this as my portable DVD player for my Nexus 7. As you can see, that's my Nexus 7 connected my, via my Samsung Galaxy Note uh, USB OTG cable, and this is the cable that comes with the DVD drive. Um, uh, and as you can see, I've got a DVD in there, uh, but it can uh, because natively uh, your DVD drives cannot usually be connected to uh, uh, these are c computer drives. They can't be uh, usually be connected to televisions. Um, the only way they can be uh, sorry, it's a bit dusty uh, because it's on the floor. Uh, uh, generally to connect it to uh, DVD uh, the tablets or uh, L uh, televisions or uh, photo frames Samsung has given a facility where if you eject the drive and then you long press the eject button there uh, then it uh, switches into AV mode and then you can connect it uh, to your television but instead of my television I'm connected it to my Nexus tablet what it does is it converts the uh, uh, DVD into FAT32 format and then so the conversion takes a uh, few seconds and then it displays the files as you can see I've got a uh, DVD in there I have my child's DVD some movies there I've connected it and it's reading the VOB files. I'm just going to play it. I'm, not, I'm going to deliberately mute the video because of the YouTube stupid content ID system will block my video. Uh, I've had a few alerts uh, from them so even a few seconds here and there will uh, of course block it so I'm, I'll just deliberately keep the audio down and I'll just show it for a few seconds. Okay, I'm going to stream it now. I'm going to use MX Player Player Pro. Okay, as you can see, that Shrek uh, uh, playing. I'm not going to show it more than a few seconds. I'm going to pause it, as you can see. There, I pause the video. If I want, I can play it again. I'm pausing it. Uh, that's the DVD is playing from my Nexus 7. It, for some reason it converts it uh, because it directly can't play uh, DVD so it converts it into FAT32 format if you can not sure if it's focusing it's saying FAT32 format okay thank you that's how you can get a DVD drive for your Nexus 7 you can use the same for all your Nexus devices if it can power it I'm using an external power for my DVD drive you can use it for all your Nexus phones uh, you can use it for uh, for all Android devices uh, uh, any Android device you can use this for the upcoming Nexus 10 tablet as well so enjoy there you've got a DVD drive it directly connects to your Android device. Thank you. If you like the video, please thumbs up the button. Uh, press the thumbs up button. If you don't like the video, press the thumbs down button. If you uh, please watch my other videos, and if you like them, please subscribe uh, to my videos. Thank you. Have a nice day. Bye.